Good morning, everyone, on this late November morning. I think it's fair to say that the holidays are officially upon us. In fact, the Charlie Brown Christmas tree is out and will stay here for the next few weeks. One of my favorites. I hope you all had wonderful, peaceful Thanksgiving holiday and weekend. And I will say one of my favorite parts of the holiday is that we hit our goal of raising 7,000 turkeys, 7,000. And that's thanks to so many local businesses, volunteers, staff, partners, just thank you so much. Because of you all, 7,000 families had a brighter Thanksgiving holiday. We appreciate your generosity and kindness so very much. We also had a Rape Response Services dessert auction, one of my favorite nights of the year, and it was spectacular. 60 some odd amazing desserts. I even brought one or two home. There was a lot of competitive fun bidding, I'll tell you. Uh, and a lot of great money was raised to support our Rape Response Services staff uh, services and team. Staff of Rape Response Services, thank you for all that you do. You did an amazing job pulling this together once again, and I can't wait for next year's event. And also, we launched Christmases for Kids. It's officially live. This year, we have over 1,500 children and families who need our support. Uh, we work with many local businesses, as you know, and organizations to try to make sure we meet the needs of all of these children and families. 1,500 is a significant lift. We're gonna need your help to spread the word so that every single child has a brighter holiday in our community. If you'd like to volunteer, please see the attached link and you can know when to sign up to sort toys or help distribute. I'll tell you again, one of my favorite tasks of the entire year. Also, I'm sure you've heard uh, through both a press release as well as just internal communications, we are excited to welcome Bangor City Hall to our Harlow Street office on the first floor. Bangor City Hall needs to renovate their building, which will take about 18 months. So they'll be operating, helping to fill up our building and we'll have one shared space. They'll be uh, in place and open on December 18th, which is a Monday. And if you enter through the back door, that's how you'd access them, which means that Penquist Transportation will now be accessed through the front door on Harlow Street. Uh, welcome Bangor City Hall, we're happy to have you. Lastly, the holidays, as I said, are officially upon us and you all do such amazing hard work year round. With that in mind, our organization has a small gift of thanks and appreciation, and that's a $100 Visa gift card for all eligible employees. They'll be put in the mail this week and see some attached information just to make sure that you get those gift cards. And if not, you know who to follow up with. Please remember that this is because Penquis is deeply, deeply appreciative for all that you do every day. And this is a small token of appreciation and thanks. We also want to note that the holiday season can sometimes be overwhelming and just, um, hard to tricky to navigate. We know that and we understand. Please, please take time to take care of yourselves, to support one another, and to find the joy in the small moments. It's worth it to take that time. Thank you so much for all that you do. I hope you have a wonderful week and I look forward to seeing you soon. Take care.